Hey, what's going on, everybody? This is Tyrone back with Tech Life. Here, I have a great article for you guys from Seeking Alpha. I will leave a link to it in the description so you guys can check it out. So just a disclaimer, I'm no stock expert, no financial advisor, so don't go and take anything I say and make, I mean, sell and trade your stock based on what I say. This is just an opinion of mine. So AT&T, buyers are about to strike. So AT&T has been changed to a strong buy. And the, the, the summaries in this article, which I will leave a link to it in the description, as I mentioned. So if you're, if you're sold on the fiber story, and based on currently where at and stock price is sitting at, I would say, you know, go ahead and, and get you some of that at and stock. It's priced very low. They, they still have a, a ton of revenue coming in on a quarterly basis. Yes, the wireless situation doesn't look too good right now. But again, you have to monitor that over several quarters and, you know, several years to see whatever is being discussed right now come to fruition. None of this is happening overnight. But what we do know, the fiber story is the priority right now for AT&T. So I'll just, re I'll just read some of these uh, summaries here briefly. AT&T stock has stabilized after rumors of Amazon entering the wireless space with management assuring response at a June conference, further claiming investors' fears. So that's that that was part of the reason why AT&T stock had dropped significantly based on rumors and now it's kind of stabilizing that those rumors are kind of put to bed. So AT&T remains on track to post a 16 billion dollar free cash flow possibly more in addition management seems confident that its execution risk have declined. So those are the two that I wanted to read and then of course upgrade uh, to strong buy so free cash flow lo still looking strong no matter what happens and of course fiber is contributing um to that as well because the arpu is much higher there they continue growing that business as they scale it wireless still helping too again they haven't taken any losses churn is still relatively low on wireless and they're still doing three hundred thousand ads you know a quarter so if that you know if that continues to lower we'll monitor that but for now the renewed focus from AT&T as a communications company is clearly on fiber. They, they, they let that be known. They're not, they're not shy about that publicly. And that's why I think a lot of third parties and a lot of analysts are going to start giving AT&T a strong buy just based on the fact that they're still a large company, still making large profits and revenue, and fiber is continuing to grow at scale. So let me know what you think about that in the comment section down below. Look forward to reading your guys' comments. Make sure you guys like, share, subscribe, and I'll see y'all in the next one. Peace.